Mm. I've been listening to all this French cafe music. Hello! So I've been wanting to try this really short bang. Something like this. Um. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> I keep just... Um, it's not bad. My plant. Okay, I'm constantly drinking tea. I just really like the taste of the tea and the little bit of almond milk. My paintings have been falling down, as you can see, because I'm using um, tag to kind of secure them on the wall, but temperature has been really hot, like 33 Celsius. Jack bought me these flowers. My fig tree is still doing good. In the morning, I was taking some time to play around with watercolor. Um, like splashes and colors. I think they are so interesting. Because now I am like committed to um, develop my watercolor. Oh! I just realized that in my recent projects, technical ability kind of limited my quality of work. I ended up painting it in watercolor and then refined it digitally, which I think is not a bad process. <clears throat> Nine o'clock. So I traced this drawing here. I still need to like fix the drawing and stuff. I guess it's just like I've been working on it for four weeks even though it's like different stages but just the preparation a lot of times just kind of make me bored of that project. The, the Inktober challenge which took so much out of me but yeah so I need to journal and kind of just sort things out kind of plan a little bit so that I can be less stressed because I know what I need to do normally if I haven't written it down it's just more daunting in my head Finally some peace and mine I decluttered the room. It was like a war zone just now and since SF is finally summer um, in October. Beautiful day, really hot. My neighbor invited me to go to the beach. Beach chairs, a beautiful day. Very windy, it's 19 Celsius. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah! But I don't know, I just want to like try to get as much stuff done as possible. I planned out yesterday so I have a clear mind of what needs to be done so it's not really overwhelming. I need to um, upload my Patreon. I'm putting too much on my plate and I am constantly readjusting and just see what works for me. I try to be ambitious and adventurous but i'm also willing to like step down if things just didn't work but i know that i've tried and i'm starting slow so that that is good for me to like adapt and just slowly ease into it i'm not like rushing or i'm glad that i take the initiative to start things as i have the idea i just kind of rush into it a little bit but i'm still happy that i'm such a go-getter that i just go and then see where it takes me. Just 
always make sure that I know that I still have to keep balance body and mind so that all this external thing can be not too much of a pressure. I feel like I'm wearing a hat. <laughs> It's actually new now. So I started, so yesterday's plan is only finalizing the drawing, but I ended up just splashing colors on it. And yesterday while I was working, a color pencil fell down. So I'll try to go down to get it. One time my phone actually fell down and my friend managed to get it down there. So I'm sure it's accessible. SF is having beautiful weather. That's also one thing to be grateful for. There's so many things to be grateful for. So I'm gonna go out now from my window. I'm burning incense right now because I need to calm myself. Oh my god. There's this ladder that I have to like pull or something. I just forget about it. I'll get a new pencil. It's not worth I've climbed down there before because of my phone. That time was late at night, so this time it's bright daylight as you can see i thought it would be better i've seen this room pile of trash that you don't have anywhere to walk it was really shocking to see someone living in that state like i was looking at it and just make sure there's no one there or i'm thinking of maybe this is a warehouse or storage of some sort but then i saw a not sure if it's female but it's thin like a a small person i think it's female wearing like a tank top facing back i can't imagine i can't can't fathom i'm baking some cauliflower some garlic powder sesame oil pepper cauliflower and a veggie burger i'm deep in my journaling for my creation now it's all my own idea driven kind of so it's really important for me to always look into my head and see what's important to me and align that with what i want to create <laughs> I am arranging the mail. It's a huge mess right now. During the day, I went to print some art print and I signed them. Happy with how they turned out. They look so good. Um, it was a really great experience printing these. It's fun gifting some to friends and some people bought it. I'm so happy. yoga mat look at this it's from sugar mat it does stretch a little persimmons is my favorite favorite food they have different types like these types you have to wait till they're really soft or else it would be like chalky this type is um, like crunchy ones but I still like them to be a little softer 
Like they have been really hard. I bought them a while ago. A little messy here, but I've been reading this memoir. I really, really enjoy it. And yesterday I went to the library and I got this Virginia Woolf. Um, I really like to know more about her stream of consciousness genre. I read like an essay. I think it's an essay of hers, um, A Room of One's Own. I just can't wait to read this. This is Yupo paper and it's just like not an absorbent kind of paper so the paint and water will just stay on top. You can see the comparison like this is watercolor paper and this is Yupo paper. When you touch the paper, grease on your fingers will kind of leave the grease on the paper so it will prevent the paint from sticking on the paper because it's already just laying on top and when there's like some oil on it, it would just have like this fingerprints everywhere. And I remember my teacher mentioned I, we can use rubbing alcohol to kind of get rid of those grease but I don't have that so I used nail polish so it ended up giving a slightly different effect when I painted it, but now I don't see any any difference. But I really, really enjoy all the texture. I intended this to be like this way. So the water and all just kind of um, move around, and I just feel like this looks way better like this way. We have been doing really well. I've been going outside here and there to kind of just move my body a little and been reading and just working and feeling grateful every day, drinking tea. Eating wise, it's been better. I've been cooking a little more even though I've been ordering freshly. It was more of my own cooking and like, you know. I got my freshly delivered. I'm good, how are you? Good, thank you. I was really experimenting a lot. Tell us about your feet. Kate, you are first. So I'm gonna go ahead and download. You're doing, you're doing the nursery. We'll take another look at your Hello, so after class, so we were talking about designing our own logo, setting up a website and stuff, and I just got a little excited. Like, things are... I was working on the comic page, it's really hard. <sighs> yeah, I just have to finish that. I'm wearing this, like, to my neighbor actually recommended me this. Sitting long hours and I do have the tendency to hunch a lot so this is really good. Make sure I have good posture. I love the light on my window. Sometimes it would shine in and it has really warm color. Especially when it hit like the ladder and stuff and it will cast like a shadow. Life is good. Always set intention. Your life is yours. Strive to be a free person. Take charge of your life, work hard on your dreams, your craft. Hopefully that can be your work and work won't feel like work. I mean, work will always feel like work, but at least you're working on yourself. Let's see how uh, AJ is handling the fight scene. Because uh, I don't really know where Montoya is. In okay, I think that was um, a misunderstanding I had in the script as well. Okay. Yeah, so I'll just go back and fix that. Um, okay, now look at that. So this starts off with a good establishing shot. So we see the rage of the uh, very nicely groomed gentleman. <laughs> Everybody gets their emotional note. You see, you can do it in the same shot. I still think you got to work on the silhouette value of your guns. So, you know, get seconds to get across there. As long as you have that there, to, so like if that's too confusing. Is honey jujube persimmon and also hot pot soup base. Tuesday is always like the kind of least exciting day. 
Wednesday. The exciting part is I get to do my narrative class work. And I just had two classes during the day, my comic class and then and then my children's book class. I really like the children's books class too. We actually do stuff in the class, which a lot of my classes now are just critiquing and not doing a lot during class. So I need to now work on color com for my class tomorrow. I just finished the color comp. The instructor likes the color comp to be really kind of refined. This is the end of this vlog. I enjoy putting all these together. Thank you for watching. I hope you're creating something. I hope you're doing things that you love that nourish your soul. I hope that you're practicing gratitude to love life even more keep finding what brings you joy and just keep growing that cultivating that just love yourself keep doing what you love see you in the next video bye bye